was back in 2010, and I was pretty sick and tired of a lot of Hollywood films. My feelings about Hollywood remakes and sequels. Well, I really loathe them. I really do. Nobody wants to, to, to see, you know, Friday the 13th and Nightmare on Elm Street and Halloween and Texas Chase are remade and remade. They're taking the same characters over and over and over again. And they're, they're rebooting character, uh, personalities, which, that's ridiculous. We all know different people. The big studios are not making films from screenplays. They're making adaptations, they're making sequels, they're making stuff from books. I did shoot illegally in Long Beach. Um, we're shooting a, f a scene in my apartment, and we get a little knock on the door, and it's three police detectives. Uh, every movie, the cops come. I thought for sure we were going to get shot. It, it, it could have ended up a lot worse. It didn't dawn on me at the time how dangerous this was. Uh, funding's always tricky when it comes to independent filmmaking. Obviously, we never have enough money to do everything that we want to do. Um, when I shot Night of the Sea Monkey and I funded Night of the Sea Monkey, I did that unemployed. Didn't have a job. For an independent film, you know, just throwing money around it, I'm sure that's a lot to uh, usual people, especially, you know, since it, at the time I, uh, you know, got laid off from my job. You're sick of what's happening. If you want to make a movie, don't let anybody tell you no. We just went ahead and did it. I never believe in him. Shall not die. You know, just the creativity is in the indie world. Every second I'm on set shooting, I'm thinking about sitting in the theater or sitting at home watching the finished product. And that is why I make movies. 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 That is why I make movies.